Hello, hello, hello. It's your girl Dazzle Me 77 and I am back with another video. So I like to say welcome back to all of my subscribers. To those of you that are new, welcome, welcome, welcome. If you're new to my channel, most of the times I do um, videos based on handbags and the such. Every now and again, I will sprinkle videos in like this of things that I really enjoy but are not handbag related. I happen to love planners. I've been planning since I could think about planning and I am just, I'm just excited about this box. So if you guys know, you know this is the Nautique logo. Um, for the past I want to say week and a half or two weeks, she's been having her annual warehouse sale. And I wasn't sure what that was because I'm was i still kind of new to Nautique. But it's items at her warehouse that she has listed like different imperfections or things. And I think she has them marked off 30, 40, and 50%. Um, but you still get to use the item and it's still usable. But according to her quality, there's some, you know, imperfections. I'm cool with that. Um, especially to get some of her items at the price. So I did want to try some of this particular item. It's the item I have, but the color is what I'm looking for. So as you know, Notique, when you order from her, opening the boxes is an experience. So let's check her out. Love it. Always packed really nicely. Handwritten notes. And honey, let me tell you right now. If Miss Notique gets some paper this color, I'm 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 all over it. Y'all, look at that color. I love it. It has a little spot up there for the dates. Yes. I'm here for it. So it says, your value is priceless. Thank you for choosing Notique for your personal organization. Your support means so much to my small, small something in me. Franchise, probably small franchise in me. This year we are on a mission to help you stand out grow in value and become more we want to stop until you we won't stop until you do if there is any additional way we can support your goals please reach out via email or chat with us online you are important to me and let me tell you she sends out emails to um just to help you with things i know she sent out an email a couple of weeks ago and i actually shared it with some of my co-workers it was how to eloquently say no oh my gosh it was so good so i printed it out and put it in my planner so i love this company i really do and i know there's a whole bunch of different companies but i really like this i like what she stands for and i'm with it so and it also has this cute little black paper clip she is so elegant and i just love it so let's slide that so if y'all know Shonda Dazzle, what color did I pick given that I was going to get it at a discount? What do y'all think? What do y'all think? What do y'all think? What do y'all think? Oh, I'm so hyped. So I'm going to look at, let's look at the pencil case first because it's going to tell you the color. I have plenty of Notique pencil cases. I just did a what's in my bag and I had one, but this one right here. Oh, it's so pretty. And let me tell you, the color of this is called um, Bliss. The color is Bliss. Y'all ready? Are y'all ready for this? Are you ready? Are you ready? Yes! Hunty, it is giving me all the blue. So it is blue and it has the gold Nautique um, logo. And this is in Safiano. I love it. Let me turn off the ring light to see if it gives you. Oh, yeah. So it's true to color. Y'all, that is so beautiful. And it is called Bliss. So I am definitely happy to add this one to my collection. And you notice all of her pieces come with this really soft, protective cover. 
Um, I'm just going to slide. Well, I can just put it right there on display for y'all. You can't really see it yet. So we'll worry about that in a minute. Now, this right here, I have fallen in love with the half letter size. So I might have to go up just a little bit so y'all can see. Um, I love the half letter happy planner size. I use this side for my finances. And this is the size that I have in this planner. So I'm going to show you how easy it is for you to switch from one planner to another. I'm using no teak. Y'all, I am, oh, it is beautiful. So y'all ready? Where are my sheets? Okay. Here we go, here we go. Y'all, look at that. It is so pretty. Look at that. And this is in the color Bliss. And there again, this has some blemishes. I. I could see like a little dimple right here, but it's not enough for me to say I don't want it. Ooh, hoo, hoo. This is so beautiful. I cannot wait to switch into her. So on her planners, let's see, I'm going to zoom out for just a minute. No, out, Shonda. Okay. So, okay. So here you see you have one, two, three, and then you have the secretarial pocket. You have over here, you have the envelope, the heart-shaped pocket. You have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you can stick your cards in um, long ways, which is really nice. It's a really good feature. You can put your planner here and then it snaps. You have your pen loop and this blue is bomb. So I don't really see any imperfections. That's probably from shipping, but I just see like a wrinkle right here. But once I put my planner in there, I'm pretty sure you're not gonna be able to see it. So let's switch it out so y'all can see, um, hopefully. So I use my happy planner disc because y'all i am just so like i like to personalize everything i have if there is something that comes out and i can personalize it shonda's gonna personalize it because that's just what i do um i like putting my little stamp on things um these rings right here are from martha stewart because I had not seen rings that gold before, but these are the Martha Stewart rings from Staples. So I'm gonna move the box out the way and then I can zoom back in. That way I can get a little closer again. So I'm gonna move into this one and she is so pretty. And all I did was, I know it's bad, but I cut a happy planner so I can use that as a basis to get this in. Y'all, I love this. And so the thing, I love this right here, but I hate that I have to put this on the outside um, to keep it closed. Um, because I do carry it back and forth with me. And I don't like for my items to come open. So when I saw that we were having a warehouse sale, did I just say we like I work for VJ? But when I saw we were having a warehouse sale, I was like, this would be a good opportunity. Um, but this is my financials, my codes. Um, this is like business stuff that I keep inside of here. Um, one more thing I want to show you. So this is the actual planner that I plan in, well, I journal in, and this is a happy planner in the, um, the regular traditional size. And you see, I love decorating and making things my own. So that is what that looks like. Um, let me see if I can turn it around. I don't normally have top down views, so. But yeah, that's what this looks like. And I do all of my journaling in here. And for, for some people, that's too much. 
they don't want to have different planners but for me it works um i like to have a planner where i can just be free and journal my thoughts and when i pull it out i'm not looking at the calendar to see what bills i have to oh y'all yes look at that with my blue um but i did get some more items so i wanted to share with y'all so i'm gonna slide this to the side so if you notice my happy planner is this size i love her weekly brief sheets um sometimes when i'm really really busy I like to have my planners like this or I could see the whole week right here. And then on the back, this is what they look like. I sometimes just use this as open journaling. So I'll use this and I'll use the back for open journaling. So I got this, which is in the white to go with the regular happy planner size. And then I got this in the blush and you can see the difference in the color. They're the same ones. See the difference in the color but i got this one to go with the half letter size um i do want to share with you another piece that i got from notique so i did get her notebook and this is in the stone gray croco and i use this for a um inspirational spiritual journal i love it and I started out with trying to do like formalized spiritual journals. It didn't work for me. So yeah, I go on Pinterest, I find pictures. I'm not selling anything, so it's not a big problem. And I just take pictures off of Pinterest, make them myself, and then I laminate it and I make my own dashboards. When I first ordered this particular notebook, it came with this right here. Um, you can see this is 2021, so I need to get a 2022. Um, but, and I don't mind y'all seeing this. This is how I utilize this. Um, these were ones that I had already done. So what I did was I put my top targets for the week at the top. Again, this is my spiritual and emotional and physical wellness journal. Every single morning, especially like when I'm really going through something, I like that this is undated because I'm able to put what I'm doing. Now, if I'm working on a goal, you see up here where I have week one, I'll have it planned out whether it's for three weeks, I need to monitor it or four weeks or however. But every morning, as soon as I wake up, I wrote how I felt mentally, physically, and emotionally. And then at the end of the week, I went back and I started to notice trends in my mental um, state, my emotional state, and my physical wellness. It prompted me to kind of think about what's the difference between mental and emotional wellness. A lot of people don't understand, but there is a huge difference between being most emotionally stable and mentally stable. Very huge difference. Although they intertwine, I'm not a counselor nor a psychologist, but there is a huge difference. And so I use that. And then on the back, as you can see, I didn't do a lot of writing on this one, but I just journal what I wanted to feel, what I was feeling or anything extra. And so because this works so good for me, because week two is missing from somewhere. I don't know what I did, but okay. Week two is right here. But um, so I did that for three weeks. It just helps me. And so I was like, ooh, this was a good setup. Let me try it in the sizes that I use. So that was the purpose of me getting them in this size. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, if you wanna see more videos like this, just tell me because I love sharing my love for planning. Anybody that knows me will tell you I am super organized and I love like planning things out, whether it's finances, life, what have you. I love it. Um, I love writing stuff down and praying about it and coming back and just just being marveled by how God works and how when you put your mind to things, they they actually manifest. They come true. 
a lot of times we we want things and we pray for things, but we're not putting in the work to obtain those things. So I like to constantly remind myself, Shonda, that goal that you want, what in your life that you do on a daily basis says that you you really want that goal? And sometimes if we're honest with ourselves, some of the goals that we wish to obtain, we are not putting in the work every day. We're putting in the work when it feels good. We're putting in the work when we're tired of our, our current situation. Or we put in the work when we see someone else that has made it to where we want to be and we see their joy, we put in the work then. So I think journaling helps keep me accountable, but it also helps with relaxing me and just putting me in a space of peace. So I know that's not purse related, but like the title of my channel says, these are a few of my favorite things. I love, love, love planning. I love to write, which most of you know. And I just wanted to share that with you guys, okay? So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like. Um, also leave some comments below. I would love to chat with you guys. And if you have not yet, I'm not sponsored at all. I wish I was an affiliate, <laughs> but go check out the Notique site because she has some really good stuff. The annual warehouse sale is still going on and I definitely support her vision. Um, and sign up for her emails. They are very helpful. So I hope you guys have a wonderful afternoon and remember, 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 be good to others, but be even better to yourself because we cannot pour from an empty cup. Bye-bye.